guys, what is you on about? Welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we are doing a speed build. Um, as we do, you know, I'm kind of like iconic, whatever, and like I'm the best builder like in the world. Like Lil Simsy shaking. Um, Xperman Sims, who even is that? You know what I mean? So today we are doing a rainbow style house because I was feeling a little um problematic and I did not know what I wanted to do for a video. So I was like, you know. I'll do a speed build because I am the best at speed builds. I'm the skinniest legend in the entire world. Like, who even is Mariah Carey, honestly? You know what I mean? So I was like, you know, I'll do a speed build because I'm the best at building. So I didn't want to do, like, your conventional, like, modern kind of house because, like, I feel like everyone knows that. You know what I mean? So I was like, you know, I should switch it up. So I was like, I wanted to do a rainbow style house. So that's kind of, like, where the inspiration for this was or, like, where that came from, whatever. Um, I didn't think that, um there were other people on youtube that already did like a house that's like rainbowy um but yeah i did not steal anyone's idea i literally just like thought about this so i literally don't have anyone to give um credit to so yeah sorry but um i kind of wanted to use as many colors as possible i wanted to do like as many um different type of styles and colors in this possible house that I can fit into one, but, like, also make it look good. So, like, our kitchen is blue. Like, I've never done a blue kitchen. Like, blue stove, blue refrigerator. But, like, the refrigerator is really cute. Like, I'm kind of a fan, like, about the whole aesthetic. I'll show you guys when that time comes. But, girl, I really did not know how I wanted to do this house. And I definitely knew I wanted to do a modern house because I feel like, like, modern houses tend to be more colorful, if that makes sense. Like, I feel like you can have some more wiggle room if the house is modern. And I wanted to make it, like, a starter home, but, like, it's definitely not in the price range for a starter home. So, if you want to, like, move into this, like, I'm sorry. I don't know how much it costs, but... I mean, <clears throat> you can try and see, like, what happens. Like, it's, um, it's, it'll be a fun game. Like, you know, be like, oh my god, like, what does this house look like? Like, how much does it cost? And if you want to move into it, by all means, go. You know what I mean? Like, um, we're gonna have some fun, okay? Um, and I was literally taking so long on this roof because I had no idea, like, literally no idea. I was like, girl, what am I gonna do? Like, what can I do in this house to make it look, like, fabulous? You know what I'm saying? But, girl, these roofs took me three hundred million years because there's so many like little parts and like little crevices but i also wanted it to look seamless and i was like oh my god this is so stressful but in the end um i finally did that and i didn't cut it out because um i was a little lazy so yeah i kind of didn't do that like you know whatever okay <clears throat> So, like, as we get up to stuff in, like, the video, I'll just kind of, like, you know, tell you guys and stuff um, about, like, whatever. So, I'm going to get into, like, my little situation. So, when I'm filming this, um, I feel like a skinny legend because I just came back from the Gucci style world. Like, you might be wondering, like, oh, my God, like, Matthew at the Gucci store? Like, um, I thought you were poor. Well, I worked. So, yeah, I wanted to get myself, like, something, you know, treat myself and I worked for my coin. And, by the way, this is not Lauren's money, by the way, and um, whatever. But, like, yeah, I went to the Gucci store for the first time. I felt poor like literally I walked in there and it was so pretty I was like oh my god it's so nice in there and I walked in and I instantly like felt like shook like I felt like Jeffree Star and like James Charles but like their kid you know what I mean because like rich legend you know what I mean and they were actually so nice in there like I was kind of nervous because I was watching videos about like you know Gucci people and apparently like some of them are mean and it kind of scared me because I was like what if they think I'm mean but like, at the same time like I'm the best person ever like how could you hate me like hello look at me you know that one person that dislikes my videos how could you you hate me like um I see you and I acknowledge you and you're annoying so leave me alone thank you um but yeah I went there and it really wasn't that bad I was expecting it to be like a lot more like intimidating I guess you could say but it really wasn't I was like it was a fun time and then the lady was like oh my god girly like what are you doing and I was like um can you help me and then she was like sure it, like I feel like I have a way to talk to adults like I don't know but I feel like when I talk to adults like they treat me like an adult because I feel like my tone with them is very, like, hi, how are you? Like, nice to meet you. Like, I'm Matthew. Like, you wish you could be me, but you can't. You know what I mean? I don't know if that's just me, but I really don't know. Like, I feel like they respect me more than, like, your average, like, teenager. I don't Oh, my God. Did I forget to change this one window? Girl, there's this one window. I, how did I forget that? Oh, my God. The one window in the front is not blue. And that's going to piss me off. Oh, my God. I'm going to cry, girl. Okay, but yeah, I went there and I bought myself a belt. It was really cute. I was like, oh my god, I'm really about to stun. I'm going to so many parties this week. So, you know, so many Sweet Sixteens, because you know me, I'm a Sweet Sixteen legend. And I have so many outfits ready, girl. Like, I'm going to snap and go off. And I'm very happy with my, like, I'm really happy with that. But I went to the Gucci store and it's the best feeling, like, buying something with your own money, knowing that, like, you worked your butt off for that thing well you don't like work your butt off like for that specific thing in my opinion I just like work just to work you know what I mean like to get experience but 
I had the money and I was like, you know, I might as well like treat yourself. If you're going to work like a little booty off, like, you know, you're in school, like you're doing all these things. Sometimes I'm on the verge of a mental breakdown when I don't get my videos done. Um, true story, wish I was lying, but I'm not. Um, so I was like, I might as well treat myself. And it's the best feeling knowing that you worked for something and then you can get that thing. Like, girl, it's pretty crazy. That's like my first luxury item like ever. And I, it just is like so inspiring. And like, I know it's just like material stuff, but like, it's inspiring to like do what you want and like go for like your life sis like I don't know why I just feel like I can conquer the world now which like I mean I could conquer the world before like because like hell out look at me sis um but yeah I just felt so proud and yeah that's been a little story time I was like going on about it um a little bit a while ago and I felt really happy and I was like oh my god yes by the way I was there and there was this old lady like with her old husband like you know there's a lot of old people in there because I guess like a lot of old people are rich or whatever um but it was, like, kind of awkward because, like, she had her dog in there and her dog was just, like, by the cash register. And I was, like, hello, like, what are you doing? Is she, like, a frequent visitor? Like, um, why does she just have a dog in here? Like, I'm kind of confused. So that was, like, a little off. Like, it threw me off guard. I was, like, um, girl, like, what is happening? But, yeah. So this is the kitchen. I really like it a lot. I never, ever go for, like, a blue kitchen, like, ever. And, like, modern, let alone, like, blue. So I thought, like, I was pretty, like, skinny about it. And now I, like, oh, my God, guys. Look at the refrigerator. The refrigerator is the beautimist thing I've ever seen. I don't know what it is, but I feel like it's so vintage, but it's the best vintage ever. Like, it came with Jungle Adventure, I believe. And it's really, really nice. Like, I'm a fan. And I think it's really cute. And I went for, like, a blue and orange theme in there. And, yeah, okay, back to the story. So this girl, like this lady, old lady, like literally like 70 year old. And I was like, I mean, go off, sis. Like you're kind of iconic. Um, she had her dog in there and like her dog was just chilling. You know, like he wasn't bothering anyone. He was really cute, by the way. But like at the same time, like I was like, um, why is your dog in here? Like, why are they li like, they don't allow like poor people in there, but they allow a dog in there. Like, you know what I mean? I mean, they allow like everyone in there. It's like not, it's not like that kind of stuff or whatever. But yeah, so that happened. I was like, okay, I mean, go off, sis. Like, do you boo? But yeah, and like the dog was wearing Gucci and I was like, um, like, hello, I want to be that rich where I can just like give my dog Gucci. Like I want to give like my dog like a Gucci like collar. Like that would be so iconic. Um, but yeah, whatever. I just like had to get that out of my system. But with the rooms, I really want lid. Like, what? English. That's like my language. I really wanted like the rooms to go with one another because like since the kitchen and the living room are connected, it's kind of like an open concept out there. I really want them to like coincide while at the same time, like having their own little story to them because like. I don't know. I just feel like once they go together, everything just looks so much nicer, if that makes sense. So yeah, I really wanted to do that. And I really wanted it to be like a nice night. It's like not lived in, but not like, hi, I just moved in and like, I'm still unpacking type of style. Like I really wanted it to just be really nice. So yeah, I went ahead and did that. And I really, I wanted to match, um, the couch and the bar stools. Yeah. The bar stools. And I think they're so pretty. I was like, I mean, like go off sis. Like, oh, it just, it, the whole house works and it makes me very happy. And by the way, if you like seeing this video, like, um, I'm like pausing at random points because I was FaceTiming someone at this particular moment or whatever. And like, they were showing me something and like, yeah, if those are like random pauses. Like that's because that's like the reason. So yeah, I wasn't just like, you know, being irrelevant or whatever, but yeah. So yeah, that's kind of what's happened. And I really wanted to make it look like, like, um, a musician lived here. I don't know what it is, but I feel like if a musician lived here, like, you know, like they have their records, they have like their pictures. It's like a musician or like some sugar daddy or something because this house is way too nice. Like there's a red door. When there's a red door, you know, it's beautiful. Okay. I'm just putting it out there. Okay. Um, and I'm, I'm loving like the whole like sitting area. You know what I mean? And I love that. Like, oh my God. I love that mirror. Like a mirror with a plant. I feel like it goes and it makes me a happy camper. So I'm kind of in love with that. Um, and I don't really know what else to talk about now because I kind of like got everything out of my system or whatever. Oh, okay. So in this bathroom, I did not know what to do because, girl, it's a blue bathroom and it's like literally like five, three by four, three by no, three by three. It's a three by three bathroom. And I was like, it's really cramped in here. Like I even feel like cramped just like building in it. So hopefully like my Sims, like don't feel like cramped in there because that would be really bad. Um, and... I like how I said this is a starter home and then I put like a $12,000 bed. Like, I mean, go off like $12,000 bed. Like you kind of snapped. Like, I mean, it's cute. I like the whole princess aesthetic in here. Like, I, oh my God, this whole house just makes you really happy. It's like really small, really quaint. Definitely like for a bachelorette or like a bachelor or something. You know what I mean? Like, I just felt, I felt like a princess lived here. <laughs> but like, I don't know. It's like a fun and fresh princess. You know what I mean? But yeah, if you guys want to download this house, it's really gorgeous. Um, I would love to see you guys play in it. Um, my origin is linked down below. It's extra with two Ds because again, <clears throat> I love an extra Z. 
<laughs> I'm like kind of dying. Like, hello. I like just got home from like the Gucci store and I feel like I'm dying. Like, I feel like I inhaled too much richness. Like, hello. Um, okay. That was like really, that was really arrogant. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm humbling, humbling legend. Like I walked in there and I felt like Jeffree Star. I'm not kidding. I really, you wish I was kidding. Like you wish I was kidding. But yeah, and I really wanted to do like no blinds in here because I want it to be like really open and like really airy. So like if there's like a man walking outside your house watching you sleep, that's not my fault. Like that's all you, okay? You know, like they're really fun and fresh. Um, So yeah, this video is about to end soon, which was really crazy because I feel like I haven't even done that much talking. But yeah, I love you all so very much. Um, If you guys enjoy this house, make sure to tell me down below. Also give me some ideas because I would love to like take some spin at like, you know, TV show houses. Like, oh my God, I would love that. That. Um, but yeah, guys, I love you all so very much. I will see you all next time. And this video is not ending yet because there's like a little bit more. Like, um, don't really know how to compensate. I can't believe I did not figure out that that window, like, did not have a thing. Like, all the rest of the windows are blue. And that one window in the front is pissing me off. I remember I did that once with the fence and I didn't realize. And again, it pissed me off. But yeah, guys, I love you all so very much. And yeah, I will see you all next time. And yep, bye.